is uh, a program tagged uh, Talk to the Dentist program. It was a program uh, initiated by the FDI, that's Federation Dentile International, to ensure that um, oral health services, care services, gets to the underserved and rural areas. The FDI is passionate about this uh, uh, idea or concept that everybody should have access to affordable oral health care. So this is a means the FDI wants to ensure that oral health gets to the grassroots, especially those communities that lack uh, basic oral health care services, like this community, these two communities we are seeing today, the, these two communities, there is no presence of even primary health care center here. So this is the reason why FDI is interested in communities like this to ensure that inequalities that exist in oral health care between those, especially in the urban areas and rural areas, are minimized. You know, remember that we have the Sustainable Development Goals. FDI is interested in ensuring that every country in the world is able to meet its targets in oral health care worldwide by the year 2030. Just like I said, the community offers us uh, an ideal case of deprivation. Deprivation in the sense that there is no presence of oral health care. That is the reason why you see that FDI, through its national body, the Nigerian Dental Association, in partnership or in support from the Unilever, especially the brand of Pensodent, is keen to ensure that these deprivation, these communities that are deprived of basic uh, rights, like access to free health, which is a basic human right per se, they are not left out. Today we really had a plethora of oral health services we provided, especially we gave oral health education both in the English language, which is our lingua franca, and in the native language, which is the Hausa. We ensured that everybody was educated enough to understand what oral health is all about and what you can do to safeguard your oral health. Aside that, we offered free consultation services, we offered free mouth cleaning which we call scaling and polishing, we are offering free restorative services which we call atraumatic uh, restorative treatment using glass and normal cements. We are also offering tooth extractions, especially for mobile teeth or periodontally compromised teeth. That's basically what we offer and some oral uh, lesions that we know that can be taken care of therapeutically. But other cases which are more complex than we can handle at this level, we refer to competent uh, dental centers who will be able to manage and take care of these conditions. And uh, we are here as part of the mandate of the World Dental Congress, that's the FDI, uh, in partnership with the Nigerian Dental Association to reach the undeserved, uh, unreached areas in Plateau State to render uh, dental treatment you know, as part of giving back to the community. Uh, during the World Oral Health Day, we were here and uh, that was where we noticed that there were a lot of conditions that are untreated, which is just the evidence of the fact that there are no health uh, avenues for them to uh, get those treatments. So uh, the NDA with the FDI you know, has deemed it as a, a way out to reach back to the society by sponsoring this outreach where we have come uh, to render this treatment to these community members. And we are doing all manners of treatments here, uh, including extraction, we are doing fillings, we are doing dentures, we are doing uh, fillings, we are doing uh, scaling and polishing, you know, we are giving medications for free to, to just at least try and alleviate the challenges that the community members are going through. And we've had a very warm reception. We were at the Mianguas place. He had also been seen, he's been treated also. And I can see that we have so many people here 
which is just evidence of the fact that there's a lot of needs out there and the little we can do today and tomorrow at least it will try to curtail the challenges the people are going through well this is uh, oral health uh, outreach to for Walkui community and uh, dura sugar community organized being organized by the nigerian dental association um, both the national body and the state body which i'm the chairman and um, we are receiving support from the Unilever um, company and the FDI International. So this is an oral health outreach because it's a continuation of program following the successful oral health outreach done in the same community during the World Oral Health Day, 20th of March. So this is a second visit uh, to attend to the oral health care needs of the uh, the citizens of this uh, community. Well, um, you know, nothing happens by chance. Um, you know, the heart cry of the community in terms of their oral health care needs uh, was well attended to to an extent last time. And uh, at, according to the Dam and Jay, in the pers um, person of um, Joseph, Dara Joseph, he said um, this is the first time an, uh, a health care um, activities will be carried out in the community and uh, those who participated and who benefited from the outreach the first outreach really commended our effort that um, we had steps were directed by god and they were very happy and then this second visit is like uh, uh, a kind of uh, icing on, on the cake so to them they they are happy and that's why you see much crowd uh, even much more than what we saw the other time This, um, they wash it for me, my BP, they test it, and, it's, and also treatment and everything I got from here. So I'm very happy. I want to say thank you for the organizers and uh, how they were able to organize this program in our community. And in fact, it has been one of the most this it has been one of the most luckiest thing we ever have in this community. Because since this community, this is the second time that people are coming here. And in fact, people are really talking about this program. And people have benefit a lot of people have benefited from this program. And I wish that this program will continue time to time in this place because many people that we're having problem of the, with their feet. Especially the last time when you come, a lot of them were coming, giving the, the thanks for what happened last time. So I want to say thank you for your coming. I'm so happy and I really thank whoever is doing this, the PEP students, the dental association. I really appreciate them for what they are doing to us here in the community is like a God's like a prayer answered by God like God is using them to help us and we appreciate them and we also thank God 